All right, a cool story for you now. Robot police dogs are starting to pop up in cities across the U.S. As you might imagine, their arrival is often met with disbelief in some cases and for some, a bit of distrust. Adam Chodak spoke with some local law enforcement agencies to find out if we might see any here soon. Adam. Thank you, Natalie. So San Francisco, New York City, and now Denver. These cities have all adopted a new dog, a crime-fighting dog that's all gigabyte and no bark. Yet there's no shortage of noise over these canine robots. While critics of these robot dogs call them everything from creepy to dangerous, those putting them on the force call them potentially life-saving. They can sniff out hazardous or dangerous material, surveil areas, and serve as a communications device for an officer trying to talk to someone threatening violence to themselves or others. Though not insanely expensive at around $75,000 a pop, Neither Rochester Police nor the Monroe County Sheriff's Office has any plans of getting one right now. But some law enforcement experts say many agencies will likely soon reconsider. Now, a fear among some is that police would weaponize or arm the dogs, but no department has done that as of yet, not that I know of, though San Francisco has allowed for the possibility of deploying the dog with explosives attached to it in the case of an emergency. We'll continue to follow this story. Natalie, back to you.